Phantom Girl 95 asks, Will you be my Valentine? If you show up to my house with a box of Oreos from Starbucks and your Netflix account, then girl, mm, you can be my Valentine. What's up, you guys? My name is Ryan Thomas Woods, and I apologize that I have not made a video in a very long time. But you know what? I'm back, bitches. And if you've been wondering, Ryan. Well, to be honest, I've been kind of sick. Boo, you whore. Bitch, please. I've also been busy fighting off lawsuits from Taylor Swift since all she does is trademark her shit and then sues me because I sing them on my Snapchat and in the shower. Nice to meet you where you've been. I can show you. Oh my god! Woo! What is this? I'm being sued? What the f Anyways, I thought since I haven't posted a Q&A video since like October, I thought it was about time I answered some of your guys' serious questions for another Q&A. Oh, oh. Damn it. <laughs> Tyler Oak is gonna sue me next. Penguin Power X asks, favorite person you saw at Playlist Live? Playlist Live was honestly so insane and I got to meet so many of my favorite people like Kingsley, Jenna Marbles, and Joey Kidney for the very first time, which was just amazing. And I also got to meet a bunch of you guys, so you know what? You guys are the favorite people that I met at Playlist. Haley asks, will you be going to VidCon? Hell yes, girl! I might actually be on a panel this year, so you know what? Like, fingers crossed, girls. Fingers crossed. But either way, I'll still have a meetup where we can take selfies, grab some Starbucks, and just chit-chat in, like, the hotel lobby. Kimmy asks, when you take Starbucks selfies and Snapchats, do you turn the cup so that you can see the logo? <laughs> I do, actually. Diana asks, would you rather use sandpaper for toilet paper or vinegar for eye drops? Even though I could use sandpaper on my butt to make it a lot smoother, I'd rather choose vinegar for eye drops, that way I can burn my eyes and don't have to deal with all the haters. Oh my god, look at all these hate comments. Faking gay, what does that even mean? I can't take this anymore! <laughs> ow! Ow! It burns! You like this, haters? <laughs> Who's laughing now? Sydney asked, what is your favorite Starbucks drink? Honestly, so many of you guys tweet me, what is your favorite this, what is your favorite that, and I think I'm gonna start doing a favorites video every month because honestly, my Starbucks drinks are changing all the time and I wanna tell you guys what my favorite Starbucks drink is that month, what my favorite dance move is, maybe my favorite YouTuber, my favorite music, and so much more. So yeah, if you guys are interested in knowing what my favorite things of the month are, leave a comment down below and let me know and I'll probably make the video. Chris asked, would you do a collab video with Matthew Lush and Nick? They are adopting other YouTubers. I mean, if they're offering their American citizenship to me by adopting me, then hells yeah I would. Leah asked, if your life is a Starbucks drink, what would it be and why? Good question, girl. It would probably be a sassy grande pumpkin spice latte, lactose-free milk, half foam, kids temp, and chocolate sprinkles on top. Yep. Sounds about right. <laughs> Tessa asks, I don't know if I'm too late, but will you marry me? Girl, if you have a citizenship other than Canada, then you better put a ring on it because mama wants that dual citizenship, yo. Yeah, put a ring on it. Twisted Dreams asks, sweet or spicy? Girl, I just love everything that is sweet because you know what? Spicy things just give me the explosive sh**. Ryan asks, what are your top five musical artists of 2014? Um. One Direction, clearly. Taylor Swift, even though she's a crazy bitch, I still love her. Katy Perry, 1975, and Coasts. So mainly three British bands and the two American skinny ass white girls. Corbin asks, what was your fave moment of 2014? Probably hitting 10,000 subscribers. The more people that find my channel and tell me that their day was made because I made them laugh or smile, honestly just makes me love life. In addition, meeting you guys at VidCon, Buffer Festival, and Playlist Live were also my favorite moments of 2014 and will probably be the, my favorite moments of every single year because I love meeting you guys so very much. Well, yeah, I think that's the end of the video, so if you liked it, give it a big thumbs up, comment down below, and hit that subscribe button because you know what? It really helps a bitch out. So help a bitch out. And while you're at it, you might as well check out my other Q&A videos over there. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!